Hey guys, my name is and welcome back to another episode of Vampire. Where we last left off was we basically did the deed of uh, ending the life of uh, Dawson, I think. Dawson? I can't remember his name, his full name. I know it was something Dawson, I think. Uh, give me a second here. What's the name? What's the name? What's the name? What's the name? Uh, from the West End. Aloysius Dawson. So we ended the life of Aloysius Dawson. We hypnotized him to believe in that his death is fine. Living on or, or moving on is fine. I just realized nobody's sick anymore. Meaning this is the this is probably potentially the finale point of no return kind of feeling. Because no one's getting healed anymore or nobody needs any healing anymore, unfortunately. Uh it's interesting because one guy one area is all fully sanitized. Prembrook Pembroke is definitely healthy, but that's because one guy is dead. If I didn't kill, if some people weren't dead, I think, then this area, these areas could be a little bit more better. Uh, from like, yeah, if if Aloysius and Kimura didn't die, I think that this area would have been sanitized in general. Uh, or if Nurse Crane and if and if this guy wasn't gone. Specifically, if Nurse Crane wasn't dead, I think this area would have been more healthy, and if I found this guy and stuff, then I could have probably kept that area alive. And yeah, if Clay didn't die, I think this area would have been very sanitized as well. Um, but thankfully, only one area is sanitized. I don't think I can influence anything more than what it is from what I've seen, but I think it's the end end game section of the game now, because it looks like there's not much left of the game due to the fact that... Uh, Due to the fact that no one's getting sick anymore, so I'm very worried that that's the case because that means I can't go back to how it was basically. But I can probably sleep it off and stuff, I guess, maybe. So, yeah, um, so far from the last episode, we found out that Swansea got kidnapped. Actually, I want to sleep first, I want to sleep until the plant grows because I didn't sleep enough till the, the plants because I already watered the plant, but it takes about a few days apparently to let it like grow, I think. Before before I get the achievement to, to say that the plant is going to be okay now. Alright, let me sleep once more. Let's see if sleeping will probably reset some of the sickness and stuff. If it does, then that's great. That means I get to continue the habitual, like, stuff in general. Yeah, do you see the plant? Yeah, we did fight our way all the way back to the Prembrook Hospital in the last episode, so we did take a lot of time to do other things in the meantime. Alright, let's just... I don't think it's gonna do much, I think, because we already did whatever we could. And I don't think there's anything that will move, I think. Everything just stays the same. Yeah, because there's nobody who was sick at the time. Oh, never mind, there it is. There's the consequence. Yeah, apparently the when I slept at the one point, it was not moving. Like, the sickness stuff was not there at all. Okay, so it might have been just a bug, okay. I thought it was like the end of the game because like there was no movements from whatever and I healed I did heal some folks and stuff so So I did not understood Oh hey look the plant It's alive <laughs> It's alive And it needs a name I shall call you Lisa G meant there we go Unlife is strange uh, probably a, it's probably playing on the words of life is strange, but then they say unlife. Alright, cool. So that was the achievement I wanted to get before I continue forward anyways. So now West End is really in a bad place, so... <laughs> Oops days. So I spoke too soon anyways, but it's fine I guess. I don't really need to sleep, but at least that XP would come in handy when I go back over there to heal those folks. But for now, let's go and save Swansea, because Swansea got kidnapped by the, uh... Got kidnapped by the the uh, guards of Prewin. The guards of Prewin have kidnapped him, so we're gonna go and fight those guys. I guess is what it seems like. Oh, this is an arena for sure. Why is why are we all the way in here? That looks like an arena. <laughs> oh, the light. <clears throat> Ultraviolet curtains and ori calcium powder. Oh, I see. Dr. Swansea's always been a resourceful bastard. I bet he never told you he had this installed in case of a vampire attack. Really? Says a lot about how much he trusts your man. What have you done with Edgar? Don't worry. We don't kill humans. 
Uh huh. Even if your friend is deserving of a little punishment for what. <coughs> what did he do? What are you talking about? We know everything. Swansea and you created this bloody epidemic. No, we didn't. You aim to unleash another disaster, just like William Marshall did. No, what? I'm trying to put an end to it, just like you are. You're the progeny, aren't you? Where is the monster hiding? It's still in England, isn't it? I have no idea what you're talking about. Jeffrey, please listen to me. No tricks. That shit won't work on me. Damn it. You found proof in the theater. Doris Fletcher was your first experiment. Now where is Marshall? Speak! She was not an experiment uh, at all. She just came about, uh, apparently. Uh, she just happened to exist. You dumbass. So much for modern technology. Time for the tried and true. So what? You Do you want... know what this is, beast? This is a drop of King Arthur's blood. What? The blood of a true defender of Britain. Stronger than your evil powers. Wait, why are you drinking the blood of that guy? <laughs> what? I'm so confused. This is ridiculous. We're losing precious time. Damn true it. enough. Soon I'll bring your head before your coward of a father. What? My my character's father. Try something else. Ow. Ow. Okay, well, I'm dead. <laughs> I was not prepared, dude. I was, like, shot two times, three times, and then suddenly, like, I just get two slashes and I'm dead. Or one slash, maybe. I lost my blood, isn't it? Yeah. No, I can retain my blood. Oh, interesting. Okay, cool. There we go. I was confused for, like, whatever that was, I guess. At least I upgraded, like, for extra hits, I guess. Nope. Come on, Reed. Oh, oh geez. Uh, I'm out of health. There we go. Got him in blood. Oh, there we go. We're backing it up a little bit. Oh. Show some Oh, jeez. Okay, I see. I see. That's an interesting trick. I wonder if. Oh, jeez. He's resisting it. Jeez. Really? A true defender of this land will protect me. Seriously? I ran out of freaking. Oh, jeez. I ran out of ammo for my shotgun too. There we go. Give me your blood. And your health, at least. If you're so innocent, why does simple light burn? What? What do you mean? What? What are you talking about? Oh jeez. Your poisonous bite is useless on me. Really? Well, at least weakening you, that would be nicer, I guess. Oh, jeez. Oh, oh, jeez. There we go. Even if it's weak against me, I'm rather getting some blood at least. Come on, Reed. Try something else. What do you mean, try something else, you dummy? I'm gonna have to Close do that anyway. This is gonna hurt. Oh, really? I don't know why he keeps saying it's useless, but I, I need it to, to heal myself as well as get some blood back. Also, why does King Arthur's blood have anything to do with it? Fight. Get your blood in. Oh, jeez. Oh, jeez. This is a really tough battle for sure. There we go. Woo. Oh. Show some style. Fight like a man. I am fighting, dum dum. Come on, dude. Why does it seem like I'm not fighting all this time or something? Okay, okay, okay. I gotta be careful here. I have to be careful here, anyways. 
Oh, okay. Here we go. I walked into the sun by accident there. Man, his lights are ridiculous. Oh, there we go. Blood. I wonder how this is gonna work. How bad this is gonna be. Right, there we go. Oh jeez, oh jeez, oh jeez, oh jeez. No, 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 no. That's a bad place to be. That was like a really bad corner. True light will cleanse you. Oh no. Oh jeez. Oh jeez. I'm out of stamina for a second. Got him. Give me your blood. All right. Got to be careful though. That freaking fire is if like. If you're ridiculous. so innocent, why does simple light burn you so much? Uh, because that's how our beings work, you dummy. It's like saying humans. Why are humans evil? And then it's like proceeds to say that. I don't know. I don't. I don't. I don't know what a good comeback would that be. It's like saying humans are bad. And then say, why does human have blood? Like, why do I, why do humans have blood if they're so evil? It's like weird as heck. I don't know. It's like a weird like comparing biology to like to, to behavior or something like that. I mean, it is true that sometimes biology does influence. Oh jeez. Give me. Oh jeez, oh, we gotta back up. How to heal up. Oh, okay. Oh jeez. No, 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 no. Oh jeez, this is bad. We're so close to finishing this too. I'm out of blood too. Oof. I can heal up a little bit. Also, why are you why are you able to do this crap? Well, I don't get the advantage of anything. It's like, he's using every step of the thing to like... There we go. Got it. Bury the hatchet. Achievement unlocked. We are the guardian oh. of justice. Prewin shall prevail. Sure. You can't accept the fact we're not enemies, can you? We always have been. And we always will be. Of all the evils that threaten mankind, your kind are the worst. Mm. Truth be told, I think I need the pre-win anyways because I'm at a point where I'm being hunted down by both parties. So the best thing I can do is just get rid of us, get rid of us as general. But then, if I work with him, he could try to backstab me at at some point, or at least end the whole vampire race in general, just because he himself wanted. Some sort of justice. Hmm. <clears throat> I want to do this. But I also want to do this. But I think he would not collab. I was only reborn for a few minutes before you and your men hunted me down like a beast. You were only reborn for a few minutes. And you'd already taken the life of an innocent woman. There is no way you'll ever let me be, McCullum. You'll always hunt me down, won't Yeah, that's there true. There is no escape, Leech. Kill me now. For there is no way you can sway me to your ideals. I'm not going to. Do I really have a choice in any of this? <clears throat> that's where you're mistaken. Yeah, because it never changes for us. What do you mean? Oh, there's no option for the third one. Interesting. Oh, uh, do I want to make him into a vampire? Do I even have a choice? You know what? I love that this is not going to really do too much. But I'll spare him. Because I don't want to turn him. I'm not going to make him into me. Just so he can die on me. I'll spare you, McCollum. I'll offer you the mercy you never offered me. Yeah, I think that's the best ruse? way. I don't care for the ruse. This is no ruse, McCollum. Yeah, I don't this care. This is me letting you go. After all, you and I are both trying to save this poor country in our own way. 
Yeah. I don't want to kill you, and I don't want to hypnotize your ass. It's not even worth it. It's not worth any of it. If you kill me, go ahead. I'll kill you, Reed. Next time we meet, I'll end you. See? Progress already. You called me by my name. Until the next time. Goodbye, Hunter. Interesting. Yeah, I'm not gonna turn him into a vampire. That's just some sick ass. Like, that's some sick, like, sick thought to make him in. Just like a pa painful hypocrisy just to turn him into a vampire. And it's not worth it because it's just gonna make it worse for him than to me. It doesn't help me because he's going to get hunted down by Prewin and Prewin's gonna make an example of him. I'm not punishing him. <laughs> like, honestly, Prewin would have tortured him and killed him, like, and taken him apart. Taken him apart. I'd rather not see that. I'd rather him just be my my mortal nemesis, like Watson or not Watson, like uh, like Sherlock Holmes and Mor Moriarty, like just constantly having a rival or an enemy nearby, just constantly keeping me in check. Because honestly, it kind of feels like that, like in general, like it feels like this McCollum is like sort of like the Moriarty of Moyor. I can't pronounce the name properly. Moyarati of like the Sherlock Holmes is just like he's a rival, but he's also an enemy to us So he knows what he's doing wrong and what he's doing right at the same time But anyways, I can finally do this weird Pandora's box thing, but I have to also go to science without conscious So we have to rescue him. Oh We actually have to go to the theater, okay All right <clears throat> I want to upgrade something at least before we go off there because I do want to be a little bit more stronger, I guess. Ooh, I can upgrade this. 500 damage. Mm. What happens if I do all the way? It's just higher damage only. 320 damage of blood, but then it's 500 blood, I guess. 915. Yeah, because this thing has kind of helped me and it helps stun them for a little bit. But obviously, it's not always a guarantee that it's, like, the best thing. Hard biting, though. These biting stuff are pretty good, too. Um, darn it. It's really hard to say. Hard biting for more damage, maybe? Alright. I'll take that. I'll take the damage, I guess. What is this? Thirst for blood? You know what? Screw it. I'll get the 600 just to see if I can get to level 28. And I can. So this confirms to help me get to level 28 at least. We had 2000 XP anyway. So we had 2230 XP. So I had enough to kind of get the stuff I need. And this is fine, I think. Everything should be fine for now, I think. Yeah, everything should be fine. This is fine. Yeah, this one gets double everything. Not too crazy yet. But I can probably go to uh, West End and just start clear clearing out clearing out the health of everybody here to make it easier for everyone. But right now I don't want to head back because I'm fearful that the vampire is going to get in my way anyway. So, all right. So let's go and craft up the stuff just in case if I end up going back to the West End somehow. So what do we got? Anemia, anemia, headache, headache, fatigue. Let's get those four crafted first so yeah the head so we got three medicines I guess headache anemia okay who else got what I, I just totally forgot already because it's like so many people are like weird anemia fatigue 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 cold fatigue so we got four fatigues four fatigues two headaches and a cold okay I don't know why we're- why is there other medicines here? I'm wondering. Four fatigues, I believe. So that's four fatigues. Uh, anemia. We got two headaches, I believe. And we got one cold, I believe. I'm crafting an extra batch anyways, just in case. Um, two headaches, yeah. 
one anemia, one, two, three, four fatigues, and then a cold. Yeah. Okay. That's decent. I can probably heal them up. I don't think... I don't feel like Dawson should influence too heavily on this, uh, the health of this particular, like, space, but it could be the case that he just, he needs to be there, I guess. I don't even know. Alright, so we need to go and save Edgar, but he's off to wherever he is off to. Um, let me see the map. So we need to... Let's walk the other way, actually. Let's walk down in the south of this area. Walk to the south of this area and like keep it at that. I think the reason why they stopped letting me get more medicine into the characters. Sorry, I had to look at time. And that, yeah, like the reason why they probably stopped me from getting the cures for some people and so sickness and illness, I think, is probably because they wanted to be stabilized forever um, and force me not to focus on that kind of thing anymore. Unless it's an area that's relatively recent for this for the story, I guess. Alright, let me see. Oh god, they're level 32 now. Why is it like this, dude? We need to fight them anyways. Got it. Wow. Ow. Alright, let me get this guy first. I guess this guy's easier to deal with. They're not saying anything, which is weird to me a little bit. Like, they're not speaking at all. I think there's a bug right now going on. Oh, jeez, another set of folks here. Oh, jeez. Get me your blood. Oh, jeez. I'm out of blood. What? 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 <laughs> Alright, well, I mean, I was low on blood anyways, and I was wanting to get through the space, but I guess that's what I get for being in the area. That means that the enemies are respawning, though, since I died there. <sighs> Alright, now the sounds are back. I hear some sound again. Alright, let's go this way again. I do want to get some XP at least, but I also want to get... Some of the stuff done. Oh wait, no, they they are still audio dead. The audio is still dead on them. Why? Why is it this case? Oh jeez. I need to get rid of this. Guy. Oh jeez. Okay. Oh jeez. Oh. Ow. Give me your blood. Ow. Ow. There we go. Sheesh, that was pretty bad. Also, they're not speaking, so it's like really weird to me. <laughs> Their audio is like really like not there at all. Alright, we're gonna have to make our way through the other human enemies here. Hi, folks. Oh, there's a priest here, too. Oh. Ow. But he's lower level, which is interesting, I guess, compared to the other guys over there earlier. Alright, I'm gonna back up a little bit because I can feel the, the problem here. I need to be very cautious. Very Oh jeez. Oh no. Ah. Wait, didn't I use the ability? What? Okay, I gotta get back a little bit. I thought I used the shield ability. What happened to the thing? Did it just get removed because of the the thing happened, I guess? It's kind of weird though. There we go. Blood. Oh, jeez. Ah. Son of a gun. There we go. Oh. Alright. There we go. Yeah, there's no sound coming out of their, their, their enemies here. It's weird to me. Thank you. 
Yeah, it's kind of weird. No enemy sounds at all whatsoever. But we'll live with it, I guess. 170 XP available. <sighs> but at least they're dropping some good parts, I guess. That could be a... That's a nice thing, I guess. Alright, so we need to go straight. And then we need to go... Serious. Is it because this is the West End? Oh, there's a vampire now. Ooh. Oh. Mm. There we go. Blood. Or at least damage, rather. Oh, I can't even... Oh my god, why? Uh, I'm gonna have to do this at least. Oh, jeez. Got him. Give me your blood. I wish that when you're biting onto them and the blood explodes on your character, it gets them affected at least. What the hell, dude? Oh, good. Oh, come on, dude. Stop. Oh, this is so awkward to not have any sound here. Oh, jeez. Alright, here we go. There we go. Thank you. At least he drops a lot of shillings. <laughs> that's a big... That's a big... Yeah, never mind. I actually think that fighting that guy is actually very useful. Though, I'm still a little partially weak, I think. Yeah, I need to break through that so I can get through here. There's enemies over there already. Oh my god. What is freaking going on here. The streets are just getting worse in these areas. Got him. Oh, there's a beast here, too. Got him for the blood. Oh, jeez. Oh, jeez. Ow. Okay. Alright. Ow! Jeez. Oh, jeez. Okay. Alright, back it up. Back it up. Oh, jeez. Oh, oh. Ow. Mm, okay. Oh. Is he... Oh, oh no. He's going for it. Oh, jeez. Ah. Oh, jeez. I need to heal up a little bit. There we go. Why? Why do you do this? Ow. Mm. Okay, there you go. I need his blood, and I'm just, like, panicking because I don't know what to do. Oh, jeez. Okay. Oh wait, there we go. Oh, this is really painful as well. Ow, oh, jeez. Oh, I doubled up? Or no, I, I just hit the... Okay, he's dead anyway. Cool. Man, that... These fightings are just getting more complicated as I'm just, like, heading through these areas. It's just not great. Alright, cool. Let's see. So we need to head off to the side over here. I'm guessing that she's not here right now. I'm assuming that much. Where have you gone, Elizabeth? I have a bad feeling about this. Yeah, she might be kidnapped and being put into like a ransom area for me, but who knows yet. Who knows if that's the case. All right, let's get through this area here a little bit. Hold this rats. Rats, give me rats, give me rats. This is despicable. Shut up, Jonathan, I don't care. Oh, let me find it. Okay, there we go. I have this thirst for blood. Alright, so we can still go into the west end here, which is nice. Though I'm worried because it means that vampires could attack me in this area, maybe. Not sure entirely yet, but... Uh... Yeah, let's heal up some folks here. We need to heal up some folks. 
Good evening, old chap. Are you all right? I won't lie to you, Johnny. I'm not a well man. Yeah, because this area has been this area has been uh, worse worse for wear. That's what it is. Your headache. Okay. Do you need medical assistance, Clarence? It's a little late for visiting hours, don't you think? Ah, uh, meds. What can I say? I haven't lost my old habits. I hope we're talking about the same habits, old yeah. friend. Of course. Have you any news about Aloysius Dawson? Yeah, what if? I was hoping he would finance my research. But I heard he's given all his money to the sick and poor. Oh, sweet. He did. You need some rest, Clarence. You should try to sleep. Okay. So he did give his money away. So that's interesting. If that is the case. I don't know exactly if that's the case. Alright, who else is sick? Uh, his wife is sick. Venus is sick. Uh, Carolyn is on the other side of the West End, which is not easy to get to. Calhoun, my character's mother, Jonathan's mother. Uh, let's do Jonathan's mother first. Charles is the detective. The twins are still doing whatever. So we got the... We got Russell, we got Venus, and we got Emmeline, which is the mother character here. So we need to get those three first. Um, I'll do the mother first and do this one guy here first. Let's give him meds. Good evening, Doctor. Okay. Uh, is there anything new here? Oh, there's a thing. Calhoun, tell me about your relationship with Doris Fletcher. Oh, really? Oh, Doris, cold, fire, and burning ice trapped in a perfect body. Our passion was as intense as it was brief. What an actress. Oh, interesting. How did you meet? How did you meet her? On a boat to France before the war. She was thinking about a career in Paris, and I was eager to try French gastronomy. We both returned disappointed. I Yikes. expect you've seen her on stage, too. She really is the best actress of her generation. Such frailty and such strength at the same time. I hope she'll play again soon. She's been away for too long. She's dead, unfortunately. You sound surprisingly sad. Have you regrets? I think of her as a divine dish. <laughs> I'm glad I was able to taste it. Ew. But I regret I could only get a bite of her mystery. <laughs> you really loved her, then? She fascinated me, Dr. Reed. I can't imagine what she must have endured through her life to reach such a level of emotion. And sensibility. All right. Okay. Let's see what he has to say. Have you any news on Aloysius Dawson? I heard he died and gave all his money to the poor. Now that's a good man. An example for us all to follow. So that means that they never... That the... Do you need medical help? You would save my life, Dr. Reed. I have not felt so bad in many years. Mm. Don't worry. There is nothing serious to fear. I have seen far worse, I can assure you. I cannot imagine the pain these people must face, then. You have my gratitude, Doctor. All right. This disease has ruined my appetite. <laughs> Goodbye, Mr. Russ. All right. He's all about food every time. All right, let me go and meet with the mother, uh, and then we will end the episode here, unfortunately. I do want to continue healing up some folks around here, but I, I need to uh, pace myself on this part. All right, Mother, here we go, Mother. <clears throat> Hello again, Mother. Jonathan, back already? Good, good. I was just about to go outside to find you. Hello. You shouldn't stay away for so long. Uh-huh. Uh... Interesting, there's some points to talk about here. All right, I'm not going to worry about that. I'll worry about that in the next episode. Do you need my medical attention, Mother? Oh, you know, I always refused to let you listen to my chest, son. Hmm. It always seemed awkward, even when I felt ill. Uh-huh. I think you should take this. You'll feel better. I'm not sure I'll ever feel better, but thank you, my son. All right, cool. Goodbye, mother. Try to rest now. Goodbye, son. All righty, so that's that. We got about 330 XP available, nice. Not really much, but nice to have some XP for just curing people and, and saving some, some people here, here and there. Nothing to upgrade yet, so we'll have to not worry about that right now. 
So thank you guys for watching. Uh, I'll see you guys in the next episode uh, where we will continue by talking to the mother. We'll talk to the mother character. Uh, we'll talk to the mother, Jonathan's mother, and then uh, get some more information off of her and get some free XP. Or we'll get some XP. They're not free, but they're, they take some effort to get to. Talk to her, and then we'll go around. Uh, we'll go to Venus and, and give her her medicine. Then we, I might take the chance to fight that vampire again, the vampire from the port or from the the port, the docks. Yeah, the docks. Uh, fight the vampire, the docks to save Charlotte's friend or get revenge on vengeance on Charlotte's friend. See if we can finish that investigation off, and then uh, after we're done with that, potentially I'm going to go ahead and. Uh, Go back to this main story stuff, or the side investigation near the theater at least, and then get to the main story stuff so we can literally get some of these things done. Uh, I think we're still struggling a little bit. We're like four levels behind the 32, but we can still manage on enemies that are like level 31. I wish that this game had not put so much of a, like a scale up against me. I think if I did try and push everything to hostile things could probably go differently depending on the situation but at the same time i'm not trying to kill a bunch of folks i'm trying not to but uh that's how it is i guess so anyways thank you guys for watching i'll see you guys in the next episode or nobody minds and hope you guys have a great amazing day or good night or when you're watching this so Roz out